photography team again. I'm just going to do a quick uh, tutorial on black and white edits. This is a picture that was taken at a recent wedding at Blickling Hall in uh, Norfolk. Uh, it was a very sunny day, very harsh. Uh, to start off with, if I press the black and white button, you see that we convert the image to a black and white, although this image looks rather grey rather than than a true black and white. So to correct that, what I'm going to do is add, first off, add a little bit of contrast. On the, on the white slider, I'm going to hit the Option key, um, and then slide the whites up, and as you'll see, the whites become visible. I just want a little bit of whites in the image. Same again with the blacks. I'm going to lower the blacks, and as you'll see, the blacks are slowly starting to come through. So we need a black point. That's enough. I'm going to add a tiny bit of clarity. I'm going to go to the Detail tab, and I'll add a little bit of sharpening. Again, this masking slider, if I hold the Alt key, you'll see that the white part of the image is what will be sharpened. So I'm going to slide that up. I just want the building and the outline of the, the couple sharpened. <coughs> I'm going to add a tiny vignette. So drag that down a little bit. And with, with this image, uh, like I said, it was a sunny day. The sky was very blue. So if I go into the black and white tab, on the blue slider, if I lower that, you'll see the sky becomes a nice dark um, colour. So I'm just going to lower that a little bit. I maybe just lower the greens a little bit more. Uh, and I think we're done. I see that was a quick edit. It took a minute. If I press the Y key, you see the before and after. So obviously here's the colour on the left, and here's my finished black and white on the right. Um, very nice. And very simple to achieve. Now if we wanted to, we could also add a slight muted look to this image. Now the way we would do that, by hitting the tone curve slide, we'll add there's only linear curve, so we'll add a few points. What we'll do is the bottom left hand point we will just raise slightly. And as I see in the images, the blacks are just becoming that little bit muted. Uh, that seems to be enough. So again, there's another version of the black and white with a nice muted look. Compare that to the original. Again, very nice and very simple to achieve. Okay, thanks for watching. I'm Nathan from the photography team. Please comment, like, and subscribe. <laughs>